Okay, today is May 20th, and this is 365 Moments of Peace for a Woman's Heart. Today's title is, He Has Not Forgotten. He has remembered his steadfast love and his faithfulness to the house of Israel. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation of our God, Psalm 98.3. There will be times when you wonder if God has forgotten his promises to you. He never does. Months or years may pass, but regardless of the length of time, always remember the plans he has for you. God does not operate according to anyone's schedule. Joseph spent years in Egyptian exile before he realized what the Lord wanted to do in his life. The time he spent in prison was not wasted. God was preparing him for an even greater purpose, and only time would reveal what this was. His responsibility was to wait obediently for the Lord to work. The same principle applies to you. The next time you are tempted to become anxious or impatient, remember God always blesses those who are committed to waiting for and trusting Him. The Lord has made His victory known. He has revealed His righteousness in the sight of the nations. Psalm 98 2. God, I want to honor you with my life. Please forgive me for pushing forward when you want me to wait and help me to know when you want me to advance. Amen. Amen, you guys. God has not forgotten us. Um, I could apply this a lot to a lot of pe uh, people from the TTC community who watch my videos. This is what I could mostly relate to because that's how I felt for many years when I was trying for baby number two. And I suffered two miscarriages in that time that I had been trying for baby number two, which is now my rainbow baby, baby Jacob. Um, there were times, you know, I never gave up hope. But yes, there were times that I did feel like giving up. There were times I felt forsaken. I felt like God just forgot me. Like everybody else was getting pregnant except me. And if I did, I couldn't, I would miscarry. I wouldn't carry the baby to full term. And, you know, I just, I just couldn't understand how such a loving God could put me through so much pain. And now, a few years later, after having baby Jacob, I realized that all the pain I went through, all that time waiting and being impatient and anxious, and although I never gave up, there were many times that I felt like giving up, giving up. Now I know that God had a purpose. His timing is perfect. His timing is perfect. No matter how long it takes. The Bible says, though it tarry, though the promise tarry, wait for it. Because surely it shall come. So you know what? If you have your heart set on something. If you know that you have a desire in your heart that God himself put there. It's for a reason. So trust me. If he's the one that put that desire in your heart. He's going to fulfill it. He's going to make it come to pass. But in his time, not our time. Because unfortunately, that's how it is. God works in his own time, not ours. <laughs> so anyway, you guys, I hope this has lifted you and encouraged you and given you hope and faith. And I will see you in my next video. Have a wonderful day. God bless.